548, Cinco. Traffic. 548. I'll be 10-6 traffic, Pan American and Jefferson. New Mexico 190, Tom, Tom, William. Black color Ford pickup, looks like two occupants. Pan American, Jefferson. If you could just know, he's been, looks like throwing out a total of three beer bottles from the driver's side window. 10-4, throwing out three beer bottles, driver's side window. Negative 2-9, block 2008, Ford. That is his active insurance bundle. Hunter, you know southbound? 546, we're going to be southbound I-25, pulling over, uh, right by Bubba's. How's it going? I'm Officer Luhan with New Mexico State Police. You understand the reason why I'm stopping you? No. No idea? I pulled out there. Over there. Up there, officer. Okay, well, I was driving behind you on Jefferson as we were approaching I-25. You kept on throwing out bottles. Some of them actually struck my unit. What's up with that? What were you throwing out? Do you have a driver's license? I don't. Turn off your vehicle, please. Do you have an ID card? Yeah, okay. ID. Thank you, sir. Mieta? Yes, sir. Okay, what am I having you, sir? I'm going to have you step on out, okay? Meet me at the rear of the vehicle. Do that now. Get out of the road. Come over here to the front of my unit. Right here. Walk over here, Mario. So what were you throwing out of the vehicle, Mr. Uh, Mieta? Hands out of your pocket. Uh, nothing, officer. So you're calling me a liar? No. no. I was throwing some cans. Cans? Because they are bottles. They are actually yeah. breaking. Sure. I was throwing bottles. Bottles of what? Corona? Corona, right? Because that's what they look like. Yeah, they were officer. Uh, well, thank you. I appreciate the honesty. Why were you throwing up bottles of Corona out of the window? Because they are in the fucking truck. Okay. Mr. Mieta, how much have you had a drink? Huh? How much have you had a drink tonight? Two, three drinks at Hooters. Two or three drinks at Hooters? Okay. Oh, yeah. I appreciate the honesty. Mr. Mieta, have you had any recent head injuries? Have you had any recent head injuries? No. Do you wear eye contacts? Okay. What's the most recent? Years? No, I wear construction. So. Okay. Do you have any eye contacts on? No. Do me a favor, Mr. We had to step forward. Over here. Up a little bit, right there. Put your feet together just like this. Hands directly at your side. I'm going to need you to remain in that position there. Do you understand? Yes? Yes, sir. I'm going to have you stare at the tip of my right index finger with I, your eyes. I can't. I can't do that. Officer. You can't stare at my finger? Yeah. Why not? It's like, I've been in an accident where okay. I had head trauma. So oh, so I asked you I earlier, but you said you didn't have any injuries. No, well, you said recently. Oh, okay. What's your head trauma? Huh? What's your head I've, trauma? I've been in an accident where I've had trauma to my leg and head trauma to my head. Okay. About eight years ago. Eight years ago? Yeah. But you work so, construction, right? Yeah. But it it's tough. Through my, yeah. And they told me that I would never be able to do that again. Got you. So listen, but Mr. Mieta. Listen, there's an overwhelming odor of alcoholic beverage being from inside that vehicle. Yeah, Standing right here, it's very strong, still on your breath. Or on your okay. person, okay? 
You admitted to three drinks. I witnessed you throwing at least three drinks out of the window. You see that? Yes, sir. So I want to make sure you're safe to drive. If you're safe to drive, I understand that. Listen. I understand that. So, sir. Mr. Mieta, if you're yes, safe sir. to drive, you're going to be getting some citations in on your way. Yes, but I you're, understand it's that. one of those things. Yeah, I know. Okay? Mr. Mieta, so I'm going to have you stand right here. Put your feet together. Hands right left side. Stay just like that, okay? You understand? I'm gonna have you look at the direct there with the tip of my right index finger with your eyes and do not move your head. Do you understand? Officer. Yes, sir. Did I tell you that I have a stigmatism? A stigmatism? In one eye. Okay, stigmatism so, in your right eye or your left eye? Huh? In your right eye I or your got, left eye? I got hit on my left side. Okay. So it it did damage to the right side, the left side of my brain. Okay. 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 So I'm just letting you know I hit. I was here with the bar. On the All right, Mr. Mira. Thank you for your, you know, I'm just that. Being honest. I appreciate you. that. I'll take that into consideration. Okay. okay. All right. Look at my finger. Bring your chin down. Right there. You see my finger? Yes, sir. Follow my finger with your eyes and do not move your head. Do you understand? Yes or no? Yes, sir. Okay, Mr. Mieta, follow my finger, please. Oh, I got you. You got a jacket on. I don't. So listen. I don't. Go upward. This is my hands. Don't move your head. Listen. Follow yes, my sir. finger, okay? Mr. Mieta, do you have any injuries to your legs or feet? Huh? They're going to prevent you from walking a straight line, bouncing yeah, up and making my, a turn. Right. My left leg. Your left leg? Okay, what happened? So, what? Huh? What happened? Yeah, a bike accident. A bike? Yeah. Like a pedal bike or a motorcycle? No, motorcycle accident. When was that, so, sir? In 2003. 2003? Okay. That was a bike accident and I have a rod and three pins. So. It's, okay. It's Mr. Mieta, listen. I want to give you the opportunity to perform this test. At any time your injury hurts you where you can't perform this test, let me know. We'll stop it, okay? Is that fair? Yes, sir. Okay, do me a favor. Stand over here, please. Stand over here. Don't move from here. Bye, boy. To go. Bye, boy. Clear for Olin, New Mexico. Ten four three five. Zero three seven nine eight four four eight five ten six fields. Negative turn to a piece, please send in and I'm gonna do this. Mr. Mieta, come over here. Right here. Facing your truck, okay? Okay. So once again, Mr. Meta, if anything hurts you with your injury on your left leg, let me know. We'll stop the test, okay? Okay. That's a good deal. So what I'm going to have you do, sir, is I'm going to have you pitch an imaginary line on the ground from where your left foot is, yeah. straight out in front of you to my right foot. Can you pitch a straight line on the ground? Yes or no? Yes? Yeah. This line's going to be... Listen, I'm listen. paranoid and I need the restroom. I need to take a dump. Okay, well, Mr. Mieta, there's so, no toilet here, so you're going to have to I wait know. a minute, okay? Yes, so listen, Mr. Mieta, this line's going to be approximately the width of your shoe. Do you understand that? Yes, sir. All right, Mr. Mieta. It's just I've been... Uh, waiting to go home. I got 
about you. Take your Mr. Neta, so listen, I'm gonna have you take your left foot, place it on that imaginary line. Okay, sir. Take your right foot, place it directly in front of your left foot, touching heel to toe. You see how I'm standing? Yep. Look how I'm standing. So put your right foot directly in front of your left foot. Switch your feet. Stop right there. Hands directly at your side. Mr. Meta, I'm gonna need you to remain in that position there until I'm done giving you all the instructions. You are not gonna start the test until I tell you to do so. Do you understand? So not until I tell you to do so, you're gonna take nine steps forward. Are you gonna be able to perform this test? Are you gonna be able to perform this test? Oh, no, my left leg is shaky. Okay. When I'm stepping on it, officer. Turn back that position, please. It's shaking. I can't. So you can't perform my, this test at all? My left leg is Okay. Okay. I'm stepping is there any, on it. Do you want me to give you the instructions to see if you can do it? Huh? Well, said, no, you told me it's like, I understand your instructions, okay. but my left leg is hurting. Is it just hurting you because you're standing like that? Huh? Yeah, and then I need to take a dump. It's like, I was headed home from Hooters to go home and take a dump. Okay, like, Mr. Mieto, listen, I'd, like I told I you, know. I have to make sure you're safe to drive. Exactly. You can respect that, right? I understand that. So are you going to perform this test? Yes, sir. I'm okay. To do Put that your right foot directly in front of your left hand. Huh? Put your right foot directly in front of your left foot. Hands rig at your side. Stay just like that. So once again, you're not going to start the test until I tell you to do so. Okay. Do you understand? So not until I tell you to do so, you're going to take nine steps forward on this imaginary line. You're going to look downward at your feet. Count each step out loud. Touch heel to toe on each step and keep your hands directly at your side at all times. Do you have any questions? On my side? Yep. Do you have any questions? I'm not going to be able to do that. Do you have any questions? Yes, sir. What's your I question? I won't be able to because my left leg. So you're not going to be able to do that, Tess? No, my left leg has a rod. I can't. You can't walk in a straight I line? I can't walk a straight line. Okay. Okay. How about this? Is there anything wrong with your right leg? Huh? Is there anything right wrong? Leg. There's nothing wrong with my right leg. My left leg has a rod in it. Okay. How about this, Mr. So Mieta? I, Mr. Mieta, listen. I don't want you to hurt yourself. You're saying you can't do it because of your injury, correct? Well, no. Well, I'm gonna walk. I'm not gonna walk a straight line, officer. That's what I'm telling you because of my injury in my left leg. Okay. So are you gonna perform it's this like, test, or yes or no? I'm not I gonna sit here and can't. argue with you, Mr. Mieta. I know. I okay, can't, listen. How about though. this? Go and face me. But listen, I'm just listen. You, I'm not. Be quiet for a minute. Okay. Stop arguing. Okay. Sorry, can I just talk? Yes, sir. Deal, Mr. Yes, Mieta. You said you have nothing wrong with your right foot, right? Right? Nothing's wrong with your right my, leg. My right foot, no. So listen, I'm gonna give you an opportunity to prefer the one leg stand. This, what it requires you to do is balance on one foot. I highly recommend you lift your left foot off the ground, but it's ultimately your choice. Do you understand? So not until I tell you to do so, hands directly on side, feet together. Do that now. So Mr. Mieta, not until I tell you to do so, you're gonna pick the foot of your choice. It could be your right foot or your left foot. You're gonna lift that foot approximately six inches from the ground. You're gonna keep your foot parallel to the ground. You're gonna keep your hands directly at your side, both legs straight. You're going to look down at your raised foot and you're going to count in upward matter by 1,000, similar to this, 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, and continue counting upward by 1,000 until I tell you to stop. Do you have any questions? I can't do the 1,000s. You can't? I, why, why not? I've never learned that. Okay, well listen, I'm gonna demonstrate I'm this test. Literate. It's like... Listen, Mr. Mieta, I'm gonna demonstrate this test. I'm gonna pick my right foot, you can pick your right or your left, do you understand? So it's gonna look like this. Right foot approximately six inches from the ground. Yeah. Keep your foot parallel. Hands direct to the side, both legs straight. Look down at your raised foot and count an upper matter by 1,000 to this. 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, and continue counting upward by 1,000 until I tell you to stop. Do you have any questions? Sure. Can you do that test? Sure. Take a step forward. Do you have any questions? No? I can't hear you. No. Okay, on you, sir. Go and begin. Pick your foot up. Continue counting where you left off. 
pick your foot up, Jean? Go and pick your foot up. You can't? Go and stop. I'm stopping it early. Mr. Mieta. Mr. Mieta. Mr. Mieta. Can you listen? What's your highest level of education? Huh? What's your highest level of education? Fifth grade. Fifth grade? Okay, do you know your English alphabet, your ABCs? No. Do you know how to count backwards? No. You don't know all that? Okay. Mr. Mieta, go and walk to the front of my uniform, please. Just walk normal. Walk to the front of my uniform, please. Okay. Mr. Mieta, at this time, which is 8.57 p.m., you are being arrested for DWI. Do you understand that? Do you have anything that's going to stab me, poke me, or harm me in any way? No? Go on, spread your feet point, please, Mr. Mieta. Mr. Mieta, listen to me, I'm about to tell you something important. You are under arrest for driving while under the influence of intoxicating liquor and or drugs. The New Mexico Implied Consent Act requires you to submit to a breath test to determine the alcohol content of your blood. After you take our test, you have the right to choose an additional independent test. If you choose to take this additional independent test, you have the right to a reasonable opportunity range for a physician, a licensed nurse, a laboratory technician, or technologist who is employed by a hospital or physician of your own choice to perform an additional chemical test. The cost of this additional test will be paid by a law enforcement agency, which is New Mexico State Police. Do you agree to take our test, yes or no? I need you to verbalize it. Yeah, no. What's happening to my truck? It's getting towed. So you said no? No. I can't hear you. No. So I cannot force you to take our test, but if you refuse, you will lose your New Mexico driver's license or non-resident operating privilege for one year. If you are convicted in court of driving while under the influence, you may also receive a greater sentence because you refuse to be tested. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Do you now agree to be tested? No. No? Okay, Mr. Mieta, what I'm going to have you do is I'm going to remove your mask real quick just to check the interior of your mouth, okay? Do you have anything in your mouth? Open your mouth. Anything in your mouth? No? I'll put that back on, okay? Time is 8.59. Go and walk to the rear of my I vehicle, my please. I wallet back in my pocket. It's going to go in the vehicle with you, sir. I'll take it with you, Mr. Mieta. Lean all the way back, please. I have $3,000 in my wallet. Okay, like I said, Mr. Mieta is going with you. Right? I said that. Thank you, Mr. 5, 4, 8, 10, go. Can you make a note at... 8.57 p.m. going to show the driver 10.15 for 10.47. Implied consent was read. He has verbally refused to be tested. Mouth is free including stomach deprivation period at 8.59 and roll 46 please.
Ende.